perspective of just thinking like, do we need Kanye West? Us as black people, do we need him? Is he important? Is he our Superman? Or symbol of hope, would you say? We don't need... Funny, it's funny you ask me this, right? Because earlier today, I, um, I, I woke up this morning because there was no power in, 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 in town today. Um, in the, the first from 7 o'clock. So I, like, I just woke up and I was like reading a book. I have a book called... It's not here right now. It's a book of... Uh, it's a dictionary of symbolism. So it, it has different symbols from A to Z. Mm. So like... Cow. What does a cow mean in, 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 in Hindu culture or in Indian in, the, in the Indian culture? What does it mean in a Christian in a Christian uh, religion? So it takes like different symbolism and what is it? so it, it has a lot of symbols or common symbols that like worldwide symbols and what they mean different um, 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 cultures or beliefs and mythologies. Yeah. And it came to a point where I was reading about um, the moon and how the minds the mind people would offer babies sacrifices to the moon as a form of um a peace in the moon mm. and i just thought about this i'm like as a human civilization we have had these things like people offering killing other people as sacrifices or killing bad things have always been happening right yeah and it just dawned upon me once again that in order for there to be balance in in, in the world there has to be bad people there has to be good people, mm. but there has to be, you know the yin and yang sign, right? Yeah. In every good, bad, in every bad, there's good. Yeah. So there has to be that balance, that continuous balance between good and evil. So we need people who challenge society, who 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 challenge the way we think, the mm. way we the norms. Like things are being done this way. We need people ask like, why are things being done this way? We need people mm. who go against us. Because through that, um, <laughs> if if you if if you were to like look at the, the human race as a bacteria on Earth right now, right, we we reproduce and become multiplier, right? Yeah. In 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 genetics or in evolution, this is say this is a, a a term used genetic variation, which which basically means that. Over the over 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 years, mm. when an organism is replicating or reproducing, there will be variations of its uh, of it, like better versions of it or worse versions of it. But it do, it will never be the same. Yeah. The same thing with human beings. We need to uh, allow people to be themselves. Yeah. To understand there are certain rules that we have to set, like boundaries. Like, okay, you can't do this because. As human beings, we can't allow these things. Mm. But we need people to revolt. We need people to stand up against certain ideas they don't believe in. If mm. somebody says, I'm not, and I don't believe in that, mm. um, we need people. People can challenge the government. People can, like, we, let's say, for instance, let me take this back to you. Mm. Um, what do you think, like, Amushelelo? Yeah, I've heard a little bit about him. Is, is he the guy, the, the guy which went to Chinatown? No, no, no. Amushelelo is the one who's, in, who's he's currently imprisoned. In, in prison, um, for his, his, his the last time I think he was in prison was over the the riot he went to cause in 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 in, in China. Um, he is in Chinatown. Yes, and also in, in Babish. Yeah. So, what do you think of somebody like that, um, bro? I'm 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 one hundred percent. I'm I would say I'm a person like that. I think um, I think you need people like that. Uh, I haven't read so much into him, so I can't like like speak a lot but of course there's a lot of corruption in Namibia and I'm not one person to hold my tongue on the corruption I've been there I've seen the shacks that the, the people in Swakopmund live in you know and the crazy part is like that's our country think of think of this right now if I were to because right now I'm in Sweden right if I were to fly over to Germany right and I take more than half of their land right yeah. slaughter kill and do all of that right and I change the the, yeah. the law so it benefits me more and then what 20 years later let's say even 50 years later I say hey that's how it was before this is how let's just try to you know tr that's that's not fair that's just bullshit so of course I agree with the person that you have to sometimes you have to be extreme you have to and, and the way I look at it, it's just like, why, 
like, why should we respect people which don't respect us? That's why, like, when I look at Kanye West, I'm like, he's correct. All the shit that he did, they did freeze his accounts. They did do that in yeah. front of us. And if they could do that to Kanye West, what can't they do to you? That he's a billionaire, brother. Yeah. He's a billionaire. And he's getting fucked over. So what are they going to yeah. do to you? What are they not doing to you right now? So I, I, it's, it's one of those things which make me very heated, of course, because the way I look at myself, I'm the master race. I don't give a damn about the others. I am number one in my head. So why would somebody put me down and say, oh, to be black is bad or to be... Like if you look at like all the athletes, right? Look at all the athletes. Let's say LeBron James, even like you're talking about uh, Michael Jordan, whoever, right? If you were to yes. tell all those people, like, you know, fuck it, go back to Africa. But Africa yeah. would be booming. You have Yeezys somewhere. I don't know where Yeezys come from or like Kanye, where he comes from. But he, he'll pick a country. I hope he picks Namibia. Bruh, the music would go crazy. Jay-Z, yeah. Beyonce, you have all these, like, these, like, we're so talented. The problem which I have is just like, bro, it's like we're brainwashed. Oh, you always have to stand beside a white person or you always have to do it in a white system. Why, why don't we just say, fuck this, we're, we're going to go and build our own. Fuck these guys, we're going to go and build our own. Yeah, now you have to also, of, of course, think in terms of you have to team up. But why are we working with the enemy? We already, we already seen that they don't want, they, they treat us like, even like in, uh, if you look at like the hierarchy of like beauty standards. Black women are the lowest, bruh. Yeah. And my mom is not my mom is not an ugly person. I mean she yeah. gave birth to me, look at me. You know, but I'm but what I'm saying is just like, bro, there's no people which think like that. Like even when I saw it, I was like when I was visiting uh my cousin in uh Namibia, I saw it and I was just looking at people like why do we think like this? 